What am I going to do this morning? Howdy folks, it's Nito with AP 2020 Outdoors. Welcome to the AP 2020 Outdoors Outdoor Shooting Range. That's Sir Reed. This is my private shooting range. Well, let me tell you folks, you can't get any more remote than this. I don't think there's any humans for several miles. So we got anything else to talk about this or do you want to go ahead and let's start let's start yeah, let's play around let's start making some uh pressure what do you say stay tuned okay alex you're pretty confident we'll get this on the first shot if you're wrong we're gonna trade paychecks <laughs> deal deal <laughs> uh, all right the noise yeah this is what shows the digital signature with the uh, okay right signature. Up first, we're doing the Remington Golden Saber, 9mm Luger, 124 grain, hollow point. One shot. Well, you kind of took me by surprise there. <laughs> All right, so go ahead, Alex. Let's the first one. Let's just talk about. So there, see, that's 200 microseconds per division. So these are major divisions. So the actual sequence took less than. Oh my gosh, uh, the the from zero to peak is probably 100 microseconds, rough speaking, right? Yep. One major division is 200, so half of that's. So what was your pressure? 31,680. Awesome. So that's it's well within the range of uh, 9 millimeter. Yep, 35,000. Right? Yep. So Remington knows what they're doing. <laughs> Never heard of them. <laughs> awesome. Next up, 9 millimeter. This is a 96 grain custom, all copper, Veritas bullet. Hand load. One shot. Is that your safety or what's that cross pin right there? This? Yeah. This just holds the uh, oh, breech block firing pin in it. I like the way you got an emergency shutdown as your trigger. One shot. What kind of pressure you got there? A little hot. 47,140. That's definitely in the plus P plus range. That's a, a proof load range. That's a proof load range. It's 147 grain berries. Subsonic, nine millimeter. One shot. That 1142 is pretty much yeah, the bottom I'm end. Sure Steinle ammunition, nine millimeter, 124 grain maker, all copper. One shot. One. Survey says 49.80. So just in the realm of plus P, little, little. Hang on. Remington Golden Saber, 10 millimeter, 180 grain. One shot. One. Ooh, that's a little bit more powerful there now. Pressure of what? That's only 25,000? 25. Huh. So that's an interesting concept. So 10 millimeter typically is not loaded that hot? It depends. It there's, depends. There's watered down 10 that's um, basically a very hot 40 S and W. Right. And there's 10 millimeter that is super hot. Loaded hot. Underwood ammo, 140 grain, 10 millimeter. Thank you. One shot. One. Whoa! <laughs> that kind of answers that question. 32902. 32902. That's clearly almost 8,000 psi higher. Underwood 10 millimeter auto, 150 grain. One shot.
29591. Underwood, 200 grain. Jackered hollow point. One shot. Forty-five thousand. <laughs> That's scary. That's definitely scary. What? The, what the ten millimeter typically? Yeah, that's ten thousand over. All right. No, well, th sorry, thirty-seven thousand five hundred. Yeah, that's uh, that's your gun. This is my homegrown two hundred grain ten millimeter. One shot. Survey says twenty six thousand seven seventy eight. That's respectable. Yeah, it's safe. Map pressure is thirty seven thousand five hundred. Right. Yep. Steinel ammunition one hundred eighty grain plated, ten millimeter auto. One shot. Thirty-two one oh six. That's good. Not too hot, not too slow, just right. Forty-five seventy government Winchester Western three hundred green. One shot. Standing back here because this is gonna be pretty violent. <laughs> Good thing I put on the extra ear protection. 48256. So that's considered probably. And if you see it clip, so it was even hotter than that. Oh, it clipped. Are you set up with the rifle? Yep. Okay. 405 grain SNB. One shot. Twenty nine one two five. Three hundred gray maker hand load. One shot. Yeah, it's definitely subsonic. Yep. What was your pressure? Twenty one one fifty six. In fact, folks, I uh, shot my deer with that load last year. Three hundred grain Lehigh Extreme Defense. Hand load. This could be spicy. One shot. Not too shabby. 350547. Yeah, see, I reload because I like to keep my guns in order. <laughs> A no kaboom zone, so to speak. That, that's a, a hot load, but well within reason. Right. We've tested up to 40,000 PSI from major manufacturers, and we, we like to stick around 35,000. Right. 305 grain, controlled fracturing, hand load. One shot. Yeah, that was a supersonic load. Yeah, pretty spicy. Thirty-nine two one six. Three hundred grain subsonic hollow point. One shot. Definitely subsonic. Curious on the pressure. I always wanted to know. Twenty-six nine five two. Back eighty. That's a good time to have that discussion. 
So it, folks realize that even though bull, a load is subsonic, you're still generating fairly high pressures. Absolutely. Absolutely. It's not. It's a misnomer. Yeah. Depending on the bullet weight, uh, you'll see we've got something in store that's uh, a pretty heavy bullet, and you're definitely fighting um, pressures with as heavy of a, a projectile as we're using, despite being subsonic. Right. Steidel ammo. This is a 405 grain trap door rated 4570. One shot. Survey says 20,683. So just a quickie on uh, what trap door pressures typically run. Um, you want to stay under about 21,000 PSI. That's perfect. Steidel ammo, 325 grain. Super sonic. One shot. Oh, yeah. You can feel that thump in your chest. You know something's happened. Still, 26,206. Not bad. All right, Andy, last but not least, what's this magic sauce you got here? That looks like a fairly nice, heavy bullet. Yeah, this is a 730 grain, 4570 subsonic Dude, seven, that's like there's 437 and a half grains per ounce. What is it, like a, almost a one and a half ounce slug? Yeah, this this is a bullet that's designed for 458 wind mag and 458 lot. Really? That Because we have the pressure testing equipment, we can test several powders to see if any are suitable to push this to pretty modest velocities, but it's a subsonic load. So, you know, 1,050 feet per second is as fast as we would ever want to go. Right. Uh, you can see how far down the bullet goes. It actually terminates right about here. Oh, that's crazy. Copper gas check sit. <laughs> that's insane. Let me see this. I can, let me get a good close up here. Oh, yeah. Is that bullet tapered or not? Because, you know, usually you would get a bulge. Yeah, we, it is not tapered, but there is um, a little bit of finesse that went into the development so that the bulge wasn't as significant. Right. Awesome. Okay, Alex, really excited to see what that does. One shot. How many grain again? 730. 730. Nice. Well, I bet, I bet that sounds great suppressed, too. 27,739. And that velocity is not valid. Nope. Right. All right, folks, I got Andy and Alex. Alex, awesome, man. You were the operator today, weren't you? Yes, sir. Right on. So listen, but folks, I hope you enjoyed the uh, pressure testing here at Sino Ammo. Check them out. Awesome group of guys. You guys are up and coming. We'll see you later. Thank you.